Hey guys, your Uncle Steve here from Forsakenly Departed, and I hope you are doing well today. It's overcast. They predict rain today, but it appears that it's raining before they predicted it. So uh, we're going to check this place out. I think it's a workshop. I'm not sure. I haven't taken a whole uh, tour around, and I'm not sure if I can get inside yet. But uh, we're going to check it out and see what it is. All right, why don't you come along with me and uh, beat the rain here. 1776, huh? Gotta love that. Here's the garage. Let's go around the back. And sliding pond. Remember these? I used to put wax paper on to make them go faster. Look at this. Motorcycle. It's a Suzuki. The front end of another motorcycle. I don't know if it's I'm able to get in. This looks like it's a barn workshop. Dog house over here. You little dog house now? Beware of dog. This is definitely a workshop. Let's see if we can get inside if there is a way. Yeah, these, do these doors are really shut. Well, I can't seem to get in the garage. It is uh, definitely locked. I lifted it up about six inches and that was it. It doesn't look like much inside. Definitely no way I'm getting in. It's just a broken pane, but it doesn't look like much to see anyway, except, you know, motorcycle parts. Here's the upstairs. Let me get some light on here. Some old stuff, toys. Looks like a radio control car. Some trophies, motorcycle trophies. Uh, may go with the motorcycle in the back there. Guy enjoyed riding. Interesting doll. Personal favorite collection here. Yeah. 
Ain't she pretty? Some manuals, yearbooks, wine glasses, more records, more books, definitely a lot of water damage in here. Look at this. This is an old washing machine. Maytag. I don't know if you can see that clearly, but it is a Maytag. An old, looks like the hutch of a waterbed. 1776, they were very popular during that time. Okay, let me get out of here because the floor is not the best. Looks like a bunch of debris in the back here. I'm not sure what this is. Let's see, it's a definite table there. It might have been a light box type of table. Graphic arts, perhaps. Some cabinetry. And this is, looks like he stored lumber on here. And what do we got over here? What is this? It looks like an old General Electric rider lawnmower. The E20. Yeah, that looks like it's in sad shape. And it's all nothing but woods in the back here. Nothing but woods. And do you hear a train? There's railroad tracks, of course. Gotta check that out. There's lots of bees in this area. I don't like it. Look at the size of these tires. And I'm not sure what that is. I don't think that fits on the bottom of that GE uh, lawnmower. Oh, I can see the train through the trees. You see it? Mm, barely. But that's pretty much it in this section. Well guys, we couldn't get inside on the lower level. We did get up the stairs, but we couldn't get downstairs. And uh, my rule of thumb is if I can't get in easy access, I'm not gonna break in or jimmy doors open or break windows to get inside. That's just the way I am. Um, but uh, the door is wide open, hey, whatever. Well, if you did like what you see, I'm sleeping on the sliding pond here. Uh, if you did like what you see, give me a thumbs up on that, all right? And uh, don't forget to subscribe to the Forsakenly Departed YouTube channel. And visit my website, ForsakenlyDeparted.com. I'm going to take the trail a little further, and maybe I'll find some other interesting things. All right, why don't you come along with me? We'll talk to you soon. Peace. Mm -hmm.